that on. That on. So the rest of this stuff would be. Welcome. So now that I have the waypoint to the ledge, I can go back and get my quicksilver. Probably was a waste of time to kill those guys. Last have that makes men risk their lives to come here. Bound corpse, pale corpse. So I'm just looking for one guy. I should probably put my points in. This is the mercy mission. I have to find the medicine chest. And there's a dude that has it. Hey, Fresho, what's up? <clears throat> what are you up to? Here's where the guy's at. You can always tell where he's at because there's like snow falling and the ground has a little bit of snow. So here he is. His name's Hail Rake. So this guy will normally kill people at low levels. This is a level 3 map and he's probably level 4. And people come in here like on races at level 2 and try to fight him. And you'll see, it. You'll see him die. I got some rare boots. That's this good. Got a ring. Than I can remember that I've had the freedom to simply help someone. I'm level seven and they're three, so probably won't get much experience here. I'm gonna leave. You just got out of school, cool. Yeah. I just got done with classes or whatever, so. Start my stream here on the GS. Probably gonna run this for quite a while. I started a fresh character when I started. So I was level one, I'm seven now. So I killed Hellrake and I got the medicine chest. So I go back to town, talk to Nessa, grab the Quicksilver flask, talk to Bessel, and we're gonna grab strike. Is that right? No. No. Spark, poison arrow, sweep, ice nova, freezing pulse. All these all these gems suck. I guess we'll get sweep. Okay. Alright, so now we go back to the ledge. You can on the boots here. Strength, armor, lightning resistance, and move speed. Wow, good boots. So Quicksilver Flasks give you 40% increased uh, run speed. There we go. So I'm just looking for big packs of easy monsters. Gonna cleave them down. Just cleaving them down. Ooh, ah. I got the bear trap for uh, the butcher. So I'm gonna farm this till about nine. 
and then I'm gonna run up and fight the butcher real quick, kill him, and then I'm gonna push to Myrtle, like right after that. I have nothing more to give. That's the plan, at least. Right now, I'm using an axe. You just ripped yesterday? Oh my god. 81? That's a tough, that's a tough rip, dude. Right before the 85 point checkpoint, too. Wow. That would suck, man. I've ripped so many times in this game. Like, when I first started playing, I would die at 40 a lot. I'd die Act 2. Um whatever that guy's name is, I can't remember. The guy with the big ball hammer and the uh, lightning attack and the rocks from the sky. The Act 2 boss, you know what I'm talking about. I would always die to him on Cruel at like 40. Then after that it was 60, and then after that it was like 80. I would always die right at 80. <clears throat> but I actually managed to get a... Um, in the Nemesis League, I got a character to 86. So we'll see how this goes. Thank you for the good luck there. Mikey M1. My breath shorter. See, I'm gonna go this way. So I picked Scion because I already have uh, other classes built up. So I have like a I have a 40 uh, duelist. And I have Mm, a 34 ranger, then like a 11 shadow, 18 witch, and my marauder's like level 6. So I already have like one of each at various points in the game, all on this league. So I have some backup guys. But I didn't have a scion yet, so I'm making a backup scion. They've really changed around a lot of stuff in this game since I played, like, a lot. Like, last time I played a lot was, like, towards the end of the Nemesis League. I got to 86, and then some other things came up, so I stopped playing. But since then, they've just added so much. And they're adding, they're adding a fourth act, I hear, uh, in April, which is going to be cool. So that's, you know, a whole other set of stuff that no one's done. With a new boss, which would be cool, because Dominus, when they when they released Dominus, man, I was like, whoa. This is taking forever to kill these blue guys. Alright, these guys are cannibalists. Forget these guys. Whoa, get through there. What are these guys? God, they're cannibals too. What the... All right, skipping the cannibals. So if you don't know cannibals, they eat the dead. So they're like tanky. All right. So I need like half a level, and I can probably push towards uh. The butcher, or whatever that guy's name is. So, I'm gonna go ahead and hopefully level this last little bit and move on. Otherwise, I might just go for it. These guys got more cannibals. Skipping the cannibals. Chess. Too late to go back now. Probably not gonna level, so I'll just level on my way. Tala Moana warrior. These are Necro Vigils. So these guys are annoying too. And they made the magic guys really annoying this map, in this uh, league. 
like most of them have mods that are uh, make them harder to kill like they you can't damage them unless there's an aura on one of them like Bailey Baleenix Link or whatever that's called. I can't remember what that's called. And then the Necro Vigil's annoying. And I can't think of the other one. Oh yeah, the Market Cannibalism. The one we just saw. All annoying mods for monsters. Mikey, if you're still here, what uh, character were you playing? Another Quicksilver. Man, I wish I would have found that earlier. Yeah. Okay, so Mikey is still here. Yeah. Bilateral Link. That's what it's called. Thank you, Mikey. Uh, open the chest, please. Thank you. You were playing the Melee Marauder, huh? <clears throat> I see a lot of people play Marauder. A lot of health nodes, pretty super tanky tree structure. You can really work on that. My best guy that I ever had was a uh, was a Ranger, and I just got tons of life, tons of life regen, and tons of evasion. I mean, I died probably six times making the build back in Nemesis. Like I, like I was saying, I died at 40, and I was like, oh, man, I need more life. So I got more life, and then I died at you know, 60 or whatever. Oh, I need more damage, or I need this, I need that. So after I died like four or five times trying to make this one build, I finally got it like working. And I got the 86, and I was super excited. Nice. Reeve. I really like Reeve with multi-strike. And I like that they added the shine, the shrine, uh, the shrines from that the other league, the original software league. Cause I, I like using them to like just charge into battle, knowing that they're gonna help me kill. What kind of skill set were you using on your Marauder? Were you using a bow? I see a lot of Marauders with bows for some reason. Or I used to. I, I guess I should say I used to. Back in Nemesis League, all my friends ran uh, ranged marauders. Oh, I guess you said you were melee though. Mm -hmm. Maybe like Infernal Blow or something. You're doing something like that. Not sure. Let us know your build, Mikey. I hate these dogs so much, so I'm gonna skip them. And I should skip them. This is actually, you're not supposed to kill anything really on this one. You're supposed to skip all this. Because the goats are stupid, like stupidly annoying. As you can see, they just jump around. It's pretty easy to kill this, like these groups on, uh, if you have fire trap. Oh my god. Pathing. I did not want to run that way. I wanted to go right. I wanted to go up in. Stupid dogs. So, I guess I'll clear all this shit. Heavy Strike, Melee Splash, Melee Fizz, and Blood Magic. Ooh, blood magic? Dude, I've always wanted to have a blood magic build, but I've never done it. Same thing with Chaos Inoculation. I've always wanted to make one of those builds. Man, 